Tonight, a new and improved version of the beloved Kiss statue is back along the Embarcadero. The statue commemorates the moment when a sailor grabbed a nurse and kissed her as our country celebrated the end of World War II. And 10 News reporter Marianne Martinez is live at the Embarcadero with what local veterans think of the statue. Marianne? Well, Preston, as stunning as this statue is, the most amazing thing about today was hearing the stories from the World War II vets about the statue. They say that this represents their courage, sacrifice, and victory. It was the end of World War II. Japan had surrendered and celebrations spilled out onto the streets of American cities. Before we ended, we all went to L.A. to celebrate. Well, we've seen the same type of stuff in Los Angeles. This moment, first captured by a photographer and now as a statue, means so much to the men and women who lived it. I was uh, on board the uh, uh, ship coming back to the States when it happened. It's beautiful. Brings back memories. Monday, this bronze colored work of art arrived in San Diego. It replaces a smaller statue that was on loan. The new one is permanent, paid for by private donations. In a military town like San Diego, this statue means a lot. That's really a great tribute to everybody. Some veterans love the statue so much they decided to tie the knot there again. In sickness and in health. Like Vic and Regina Miranda, they've been married for 70 years. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Other couples got in on the action too, recreating their own unconditional surrender, as the statue is called, remembering the romance and resilience of the greatest generation. Now, in 1945, when this statue, the year this statue commemorates, you might never have expected to see what you hopefully are looking at right now. Those are cherry trees, Japanese cherry trees. Of course, we fought against the Japanese then, but here they are today, donated by the Japanese Friendship Society from Balboa Park. At the Embarcadero, Marianne Martinez, 10 News. The image is timeless. Thank you, Marianne.